Hey guys, it's Kate from Walk Truck Canner, and today I'm going to be doing a saddle pad collection video, and I'm really excited. I don't really have that many saddle pads compared to some other people, but I thought I would do this video because I thought it'd be fun to show you like what saddle pads I use and stuff like that. So let's get right into it. Okay, so this first pad that I'm showing you is like my baby. I love this so much. This is the Fleeceworks half pad. And it's kind of dirty because none of my saddle pads have been washed prior to this video. So just try and ignore that aspect of it. But this is a really, really awesome saddle pad. It's a half pad as you can see. And it's sheepskin and I really like how it's like fluffy. Like, I don't know, I just really like it. And the back is really soft too, so I, if I was a horse I would like this. And it's got like the side straps that attach to your saddle. And I just use this all the time for schooling. This is like my main one that I use. And sometimes I won't use anything underneath it if it's like during the summer or something. And it's just really nice all around and it looks really good. And yeah, I really, really, really love this. And that's all I can really say about that one. This next pad I got um, on consignment actually because I needed a show pad really fast and this was on consignment at my local tack shop. So it is the Wilkers, Wilkers if you can see that, um, just shaped pad and as you can see it's one of those ones that have like the grippy things on the inside and on the out that um, like grip to your saddle instead of using the straps that attach to your billet straps. So, um, I really like it. I don't find that it moves. I was concerned when I first got it that it might kind of like slide around if it didn't have the um, straps attaching to your saddle. But these actually work pretty well and keep my saddle in place. And yeah, it was very inexpensive. I got it for like 20 bucks maybe. And I don't think it was that expensive to begin with. But it's just a really great show pad and I really like this as well. Okay, so now I'm going to show you my two baby pads that I have. So this is quite possibly my favorite um, saddle pad for the summer because um, first of all it's a baby pad which means it's like a lighter version of a regular saddle pad. So um, it's like cotton material and it's really, sorry I won't show you the underside because it's really dirty, but it's really lightweight and just all over great because it breathes easily for the summer. So this is by Letitia, if you can see right there, Letitia. So as you can see it's just this white pad and it has a baker trim, which I think is really cute and just adds a nice accent so it doesn't look like everybody else's baby pad. Um, and also something that I like about this pad that not many baby pads have are these, um, these, like, I forget what they're called, um, I don't know. These things that your girth go through when it attaches to your saddle. Now, most baby pads would just be, like, a piece of, like, cloth. There's no straps that attach to your, um, billet straps, and then there's no little, like, hook that your, um, girth can go through and that this having that little strap I find adds a lot more security to um, your saddle pad so it won't slip around or anything when you're riding and I really really like this and this is like all I've been using this summer and it's really nice so my next baby pad is just an all white baby pad it doesn't have any straps or anything um, and it came in a pack of three so you'd always have a clean one so um, if you're like, if you use one and then you wash one, you'll have another one ready to go. So I have a pack of three of these and um, they're really nice and like light and um, they're really nice material and I'm pretty sure this is by like the Dover brand. I don't know. I ordered it from Dover online and it has like the monogramming. So this is like a burgundy diamond with my initials in them. Um, so yeah. And there's not really much to say about this other than it's pretty long, so I find that sometimes that can be, like, a problem. Um, but you can always, like, fold it back like that. That's what some of my friends do, but I just don't really like doing that. 
So I definitely prefer my other baby pad, but I'll definitely use these, especially since I have three of them, and I think that they're nice, they work well. Okay, so now I'm getting into my regular saddle pads. So the first saddle pad is this, like, corally one, um, that I got from Horseman's Outlet, and it is by the brand Pacific Rim International, or PRI, so... Pacific Rim International, and I really like this. It's definitely pretty heavy compared to like a lot of pads. It's really nice because it has, of course, because this is just like a regular saddle pad, it has these straps and the little hook that your um, girth goes through. And I like that it has like it's kind of angled up um, to accommodate your horse's withers, and I think that that's a really smart idea because I think a lot of, um, saddle pads don't have that, so the shape just will fit your horse really well. Overall, I like, I like the color, I like that it has, like, this, um, trim on it as well, and it's just a nice material, and I really like it. That was a little bit more expensive, though, that was more on the pricey side, um, but it's still nice. And my last pad that I have to show you today is this mint green one. And this is from, the it's like the Dover Saddlery um, Cotton International pad or something. This was like the first saddle pad that I ever had. And it's just, it's really nice because it's very inexpensive um, for the quality. So it's pretty padded and thick. It's got, of course, like the straps for your billets and this too because it is a regular saddle pad. It doesn't have like the slanted upward thing, but I find it still works relatively well. Of course, I would prefer um, it to have that shape, but this really works nicely. It looks good on like all horses, and I really, really like this. So that was my saddle pad collection. I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. Leave any requests down in the comments below, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!